Hello guys, this is my Brachypoma bomi, the Mexican fireleg. Uh, hence the title of the common name. Uh, this one originates from Mexico. It is a terrestrial, which means it prefers to be on the ground versus in the trees. Um, they are skittish, very hair flicky. So I uh, expect this particular tarantula to uh, have a bald abdomen quite a bit, especially the, the more you disturb it, the more bald the abdomen's going to be. Um, they don't get to be huge. Uh, they, they grow up to be about a half, five and a half inches in leg span. So about average size tarantula. Um, as far as the temperature level goes, just keep it, you know, if you're comfortable, your tarantula is comfortable. Humidity levels, nothing special. Uh, just like with what I do with my other slings, um, I just uh, dampen part of the substrate with a spray mister bottle, and that's what I did on this side. You can see it's a little damp over here. So if it chooses to drink, it can go over there and uh, drink water off of the sides of the enclosure or on the substrate itself. Um, most tarantulas, I mean, tarantulas get most of their liquid uh, by their food anyway, but it's always good to have water as well. And as you can see how fast this one moves, it is skittish. <laughs> but uh, yes. So what we're going to do, if you'll be still, is uh, give you a cricket. Are you interested? Sorry that took me a minute. As usual, a cricket escaped on me. Well, what do you think? You want it? It's a big one. They are very good eaters. You gonna make a liar out of me? You gonna make a liar out of me? There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> that was a cute attack, wasn't it? Slings look really cute when they attack their food. Bracky Palma Bomi, Mexican Fireleg. This is my favorite Bracky. Uh, if you've watched my other videos uh, where I feature this one, I tell you how much uh, this one's my favorite of all the Brackies. I just, I love the colors. The legs are reddish orange. I really can't wait till this one grows up. I really hope it's a female. Because this is one of my all-time favorite tarantulas. I might put this one at number three. Of all tarantulas out there, this might be my third favorite. I think that was the biggest cricket in the... Uh, little containers so I gave that one the, the good portion I see we uh, lost a leg in the scuffle well not the tarantula the cricket <laughs> Yeah, that cricket's history. <laughs> That's funny. You can see a little leg twitching. 
It's like, help, help. Nope, your dinner. Bottom of the food chain, pretty much. Oh, if you hear snoring, that's my dog over there. My dog snores. Hopefully you're not bored as she is. <laughs> well, I was hoping this one would uh, do some webbing for us, but I guess not. So I'm going to take a few pictures, and uh, we'll move on to our next tea, which will be the uh, Bracky Pomo. Ooh, there we go. A little movement. Oh, there we go. Got just a little bit of webbing there. Uh, the next tea I'll feature will be the Brachypama Smithy, but uh, we'll end it. Uh, this is the Brachypama Bomi Mexican Fire Leg. Thanks. <laughs>